Hey, it's JT here, Hoagie's Garage, uh, in the Impala, and I wanted to show you something I'm using on the leather, uh, factory leather seats. It's obviously it's Chevy leather. It's decent. It's good, not great. Um, but anyways, it is the gray leather. It's actually in really nice shape. So I talked to McGuire's and I told him kind of what's going on with the project. You know, I'm not looking for something that takes tons of time and, you know, it's just something I want to maintain and keep it looking nice. I'm going to have the driver's seat rebuilt, redone, different stuff to it because uh, it's got 180K on it. Uh, Meguiar said this stuff is pretty solid. It's the Meguiar's Gold Class Leather and Vinyl Cleaner. Uh, pretty simple, really. You use a microfiber cloth. You, uh, you can spray it on the cloth or on the seats and you just sort of wipe it off. This is to get rid of dirt, grime, grease. Um, and it actually does work. It's taken off a few little spots I noticed uh, that looked, you know, not exactly perfect. So it's, you know, kind of does a nice job. And it says it doesn't remove like the oils and stuff like that that's in the leather. Um, so it kind of leaves what they call a like new finish. Just nothing on it, clean and ready to apply what they recommend next is their Meguiar's Gold Class Leather Conditioner. One thing they did tell me, this being the perforated leather, you can see the holes in it from the factory, it's like that. Uh, you don't want to use something that's real like, uh, they said like a paste or like a cream type of stuff because it does get into those holes and dries and then you have, you know, dried up gunk in all the holes. So. Uh, this stuff, same thing. It says you can spray it uh, directly on the leather or on your uh, microfiber. It is does kind of come out a little thicker than the other stuff. Um, and you just rub this stuff in and it won't fill in the holes. Won't make a big mess. And this kind of stuff I like to put on at night after I've gotten home or, you know, the car's going to sit for a little bit because you don't want it to absorb into somebody's pants or something like that or something you set on the seat uh, instead of the leather. So that's going to sit in there and uh, it does kind of have a little bit of a shine to it but I think once it dries and absorbs into it it's going to dull out a little bit. So um, two pretty solid leather cleaning and conditioning products from Meguiar's. They did send me this gold class leather conditioner in a wipe form as well which would be cool to have in the glove box or you know in the trunk if you're ever just I guess bored someday and you're sitting somewhere waiting you can kind of uh, condition your your leather in your car so a couple good things from Meguiar's um, updates on the Impala project I'm gonna do the rear end here uh, put the uh, PML diff cover on and uh, also it's gonna get the spoiler fitted here uh, very very soon just been having some timing issues with that so thanks for watching uh, check for more updates on the Impala project and I will talk to you very soon